Are we on? Yep. All right, we've got Jesse Murph with us. Hello. We need a little snoop moment. <laughs> Dude, okay, I've never actually seen these, so like, were these custom for you or? These are custom for me, but there's a dude that all he does is make snoops. I freaking love that. It's really fire. It'd be a cool career, I think. I was gonna say, well, I saw you were like in a video um, to be on TikTok. You were like, I'm bringing these to the gym too. Yeah. Then you like literally work out in the snoots. Like, I was like, does she really work out in the snoots? If I don't have shoes with me, like if I just, if I go on a trip and I just bring these, they work. I mean, they are tinny. You're like, whatever, I can squat them. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. But, um, so, I thought it was really cool, um, uh, you literally would have graduated high school, like, a couple weeks ago. Yeah. And you're traveling the world, so, what, what is that like for you? Like, how was that just seeing your peers graduate, and them seeing you where you are now? Like, how has that affected you? It's bittersweet when they graduated, I just remember being like, damn. It feels like, I just feel kind of old. Yeah. Um, but I'm also so grateful to be doing what I'm doing. And of course. So That's another why people love you and the industry has been shocked because you're saying things they don't think an 18 year old would say. But it's like, obviously that's why you have such an amazing fan base because they're connecting with that because somebody's actually speaking about things that they have also gone through and you have. So I just wanted to say like, thank you for doing that. And that could be really hard. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> no, of course, like I could see you on stage, like getting emotional. And I was like, is that hard for you? Even though you are so brave, obviously to release these songs and to write for the but is that hard sometimes to perform those songs? 100%. It's especially hard when my family's there because I don't want them to see me like that. Um, and yeah, it's hard to be, I think it's harder to be vulnerable in front of people that you deeply care about and that you're like close to and know so well. Yeah. Um, so that's when it feels not great. Yeah. But yeah, you're like, this is really real right now. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I can't imagine that. Um, but on a positive side, Nothing Else Matters is yeah. on the Fast and Furious. Crazy, dude. Dude, I freaked out. You so sound crazy. so great on Thank that Thank you. Yeah. It was a bitch to record. <laughs> like, we, had to do a lot of stuff. It was also, it's so, like, out of my range. It's, like, really high. And, um, yeah, we had to recut it, like, nine times. Hey, but you got it. But we got it. But we freaking right, got it. Dude. So how did that opportunity come? Was it something that, you know, they came to you and you are like, you'd be the perfect voice on it? Or did it just kind of fall in your lap? Like, how did that come about? I think it was something like that. It had to do with people talking. Yeah. I don't, I don't really know. You're but like, I'm here. I, yeah, for a while I didn't think it was going to work because we kept having to recut it. I was just like, yeah. Um, but yeah, it worked out. It was sick. I'm super happy. <laughs> Hi, happy all the time. Um, yeah, dude. Yeah, you're it's like, really I am just, well, you're killing it. So Thank you. don't worry about that at all. Yeah. But um, so also, you did Cowboys and Angels. I did. Today, you sang it for the first time. Yes. I love that. I know it's almost kind of leaning towards country a little bit. Yeah, like it's, it is. Tailoring that line, and I love what you're doing. You're doing like rap too. I'm like, this girl is a bad bitch. Like, what is she doing? Of course. So, is that something you think you'll like probably lean more towards in your next releases after that? Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Yeah, 100%. It's like a, like, it's really There's like, so much. I just want to be able to like tell everybody because I have so much fun in stuff pertaining to that genre. Um, but yeah, it's always going to have like a little rap, I guess. And your stuff. I'm never going to be full country, but yeah. I'm definitely stepping more into that, and it comes from where I'm from, obviously. Yeah, sweet home Alabama, right? Yeah, dude. Like, every time I tell people I'm from Alabama, they're like, roll tide. I'm like, roll tide. <laughs> <laughs> like, whatever. I feel that, I feel that. Yeah, okay, well, awesome. Um, well, thank you so much for doing this interview. Thanks for having me. Of course, girl. I can't wait to see your career. I mean, girl, you're going to go to the Thank you. Thanks a lot. Of course.